Um, this is May again. You know, tape in. We're driving um, along Sparrow. Actually, um, it's a different car. And the first car I was using got shut down. You know, you know mechanical fault. But I'm driving in town to pick up some stuff. And it's not easy, you know. Like, down here, it's like pretty good. You know, well, made a lot of things and do a lot of things, a lot of progress. It's like very happy about that. And I'm telling whosoever out there, Africans or Sierra Leoneans, it's very important for you to come back to your home country and try to see what's really going on, like infrastructure wise. And um, you never know what the outcome can be and try to come back and develop your country. Um, my plan actually is to develop the basketball aspect and um, got a lot of investments also, you know, at least I can help my people, you know, in terms of job-wise, because it's like, that's the problem here, you know, people don't have jobs, but it's like, it's so uh, good, when I come back, it's like, everybody was so happy to see me, it's like, I'm like a local king. Everybody month for month for month for day, month for day, they month for that. It's like my popularity like grows because it's like the way I try to push myself and try to go somewhere else where I can achieve, you know, something to be, you know, somebody better in life. You know, it's like um, it's hard over here actually. It's like guys that I used to play with. Um, <coughs> I don't know, they're doing something else, man, something else different. And it's so pathetic, you know, like when I know exactly what they do. And I was like, damn, yeah, man, a lot of talented guys, you know, just wish they were having the opportunity, like in sports wise, uh, you know, at least they should have been far by now. But uh, all the same, um, we're trying to make that difference, you know, try to like talk to people out there and try to see how progress can come down here and develop some stuff. Actually, this is borrowed, and actually, uh, this is to be a very, very important area in the country where you have all the ministers, you have the embassies. Um, this is the uh, Liberia Embassy, as you see there. And in front of me, if you keep watching, you can see a flag ahead um, that's the British Embassy um, actually they're here but issuing visa is another thing you know a lot of problems that's the British Embassy right there and um, I'm going off a place called Wilberforce and then try to take Intercultural which is a shuttle road in order to get to town and this is the Liberian Embassy as you can see it's on renovation and they got a lot as I said to you guys, going on. That's the next embassy here. I don't know which embassy is that. Okay, it is the embassy of Greece. And it's like stuff is happening down here, but I'm um, very happy that I'm here, man. It's like, not easy, you know. I got houses. We used to get a house like that right up there. And you know, like, we got massive buildings going up. Construction the roads, we're in the traffic because the truck is ahead of us. And um, there's a sparrow, uh, they're climbing up. And you used to know a lot of people around here. There were still know, you know, a whole lot of people around here, as you can see. There's an ex building, nice building, which a development. But the thing is, it, man, the house in there, like really bad, nice house. When I was a little boy, I used to say, damn, that can be something of my dreams, but it's secure. It's like, you can actually get in there, um, because of um, security-wise, you know, the gate is um, electrified, and um, uh, you need to know somebody in the channel before you can get in there, so, I don't know. Um, Stay going downtown, trying to go in town and pick up some stuff. Um, as I said, um, I'm 
doing this tape so it's like I can post it up, you know, on, on YouTube or whatsoever. So actually, <coughs> whoever want to see um, Sierra Leone or uh, like some areas in Sierra Leone, uh, you know, you can actually know because most people think like Sierra Leone is like a village wise and they don't have beautiful cars over here, nice houses, you know. And it's so crazy. Uh, this used to be uh, the president place, it's like a president lodge. But it's like it is like secure now, and nobody stays there. And from here, you can get a clear spot where I start doing this taping. You know, it's way down there, which is like no lumbling. Uh, they say like Sierra Leone is like a lion mountain because how the place are like, you know, like cave wise, very very beautiful place. I mean, I guess you, um, if you guys continue to take a look at the videos, you will definitely see a uh, tip like the beach, you know, like in town where you can get the ministry buildings and um, I tip some other areas also where you can see a lot of important things that, uh, you know, Sierra Leoneans, Africans need to know about Sierra Leone. But people over here in terms of living, let me think. It, 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 it's not too good, you know. It's like you need to have somebody out there, or <coughs> you know, that can really support you because it's like it's really, really not easy. But all the same, I'm trying to do, you know, some jargons over here, some taping stuff, you know, whereby you can say, okay. actually, there's an area, military area. I don't want to get caught up. Taping. Stop. Hey, yo, you mustn't do that. Why you do know that? Pull over. Now, a couple of dollars gonna die. <laughs> so, I'm trying to avoid that. I'm way back to what I'm saying about the tape. This is a place called um, the Tati The Tati is like a military, you know, zone. You know, a military zone. It's like, man, right here, you got a military bags, and it's like, um, you got a military hospital, which is called Tata Four. You got a school, it's called Savage's School, and everything. But it's like most times you see the uh, military personnel, it's like control of traffic, um, MP, you know, military police. And um, but now it's like they knock. Okay, I had to my right one in the green. Okay, that's one of them. But like seems to be tired, so taking a, a little rest. And um, we're still going driving along. Um, the Wilberforce area, and um, now this is an old building, you know, uh, but they're trying to see how they can construct those buildings again, oh, uh, sorry, rehabilitate or renovate, um, try to see how they can renovate those buildings again, you know, so, you know, to a better standard, and that's a gas station right there, you know, a gas station, you know, like, some are in good conditions and, and some are not, because Never forget, you know, the country was in war and a lot of stuff was destroyed. And um, the country is just trying to come back to some development speech, but we still do need help. A lot of help that can make um, the average Sierra Union, you know, life be comfortable, whether it's like medication, education, and shelter, and, um, you know, transportation also. And we do believe like people out here really want to help, but you just need to know um, the right person, you know, that you can coordinate to it that, you know, this help can, you know, can happen. Going down, there's a place called um, Hill Station, and I'm taking a turn right here, and it's a place called Hill Culture. The building in front, that's the Nigerian Embassy, and um, going down this place called Hill Culture man it's a crazy drive okay it's a very very crazy and narrow drive so it's like if you know you can't drive don't try because you might bounce some bar bounce over take a look at the road guys it's like see like very narrow man narrow man you got some people when you get to call, you gotta check, man. Or else you might crash and you know into somebody's car. 
from there you got some nice views you know of the hills and you can see the entire city you know from this spot and which is cool which is nice man it's like awesome and um, I'm still driving because I'm trying to go downtown you know so I have the opportunity to do this tape um, so guys can know what time is it you know you better come back because by the time you're back man everywhere is gone man you guys have to be buying the houses man a lot of millions man because there'll be no more space you know land you know for you to do your own stuff hmm, you gotta buy somebody else and you gotta break it down in order for you to construct your own houses it's like this place is called the hill control call the hill control I don't know I wasn't born actually yet when this road was constructed but um, it got a lot of cuts you know a lot of tons and uh, maybe it's a shortcut also you know downtown this is the area where guys wash cars bike and these are like places where people come in you know developing you know the areas and, and you know stuff like that and yeah, this guy runs, I don't know what he's doing man stuff like that but it's a pretty nice place and I'm driving downtown still you know to I don't know I don't know what's up what's going on you know so now what what time is it so still on the culture and I'm trying to see how we can make this happen there's a drive Cultural, we're still on the hill cultural, still going. That's a beautiful sign box. Now road. And man, I love this road, man. Back then we used to do racing here, man. Kind of racing, man. Trust me, man. I love this road, man. And I'm driving a right hand car, man. But over here they drive the left hand. So you driving a right hand car here? Man, you gotta be skillful. <laughs> skillful. A whole lot of skill. Because you want to overtake. Man, you can see. Man, you gotta like, you know, dodge, you know, over and right, you know, right and left. And until something happens. But thank God. I practice very well. You know, to make it happen. El Cultural, that's what I say. We're still going. And, uh, yeah, actually, we're coming to the end of the cultural now. Almost there. Almost to the end of the cultural. And when we get to the end, we're gonna arrive um, a place called Kim Kingaman Road Junction. Um, Kingaman Road Junction is a nice area as well, where you got a lot of nice buildings. You got schools. And even the church that I attend uh, last Sunday, well, it was located out in Kiona Road Junction. And um, almost to the end of the hill culture, so we can see here. Okay, that's the end of the hill culture. That's the end of the That's how people drive this. They can't wait, man. That's the end of Hill Culture. Going down there, that's King of Maria Junction. Right down there. And I keep going straight because I'm going downtown. So, I'm going downtown. Um, this is, uh, this used to be a hotel, but now somebody told me it's like a, 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 a university. And this is going down. This is a school called International. My sister, you know, kids attend the school. It's like one of the best schools, you know, in the country. Well, it's fans, as you can see, it's called International School. It's right there at the time. And I still keep going down. We're getting down to a place called New Englandville, where you have the, the TV station. And on my left, there's a court there called um, the Special Court. That's the Special Court right here where they have uh, trials for the people who commit out the war in Sierra Leone. And on my right hand, that's uh, the 
TV station. And this area actually is called in England here. Uh, the TV station on my right hand. 